Hi, I'm the Barbecue Butcher. Today, I have a very special guest star joining us today. It's the Mini Barbecue Butcher, and he's got something to tell us. We got first prize in the barbecue comp. Woohoo! Alrighty, we got first prize down at King of the Mountain. We were representing Barbecue Boy from the Bay of Islands. And the brisket that we used was this Carrara Wagyu brisket. It got a perfect 300. Very hard score to get when it's perfect. But anyway, I'm going to take you through a quick trim of it and show you what this beauty of a brisket that's winning all the comps around. You got a nice big mohawk up here and you got a little flat and I'll show you some of the marbling that you can see already coming through haven't even trimmed it so we'll spin it over and again you can just see the marbling running through these Carrara briskets I take a little bit off here just to show you the marbling underneath take a little bit more off here just to show you some more just the marbling is amazing most of the guy when they come out of the factory they're already trimmed like this really not much waste on them at all so you don't need to do much trimming uh, if you're just doing it at home on your big green egg like I use all the time uh, for a tournament spec uh, you would do a little bit more but hey this is just for home so that's how I do mine Come off up the top here a little bit. Show you some more of the the marbling. This stuff's awesome. Take a bit off there, and then I just want to cut through here, even it all up, and then show you inside all the marbling. This is what all the pit pit masters are wanting to see. Just all the marbling, and the great thing about it. It doesn't have chunks of fat all over it like a lot of the other Wagyu brands out there. This is just genetics awesomely done for this Carrara stuff. So I mean, I've already trimmed out in here a bit. They come already trimmed. And that's... There we go. And this, this brisket was 8 kilos. It is 8 kilos. And this is all really I, I take off. You could take, if you want to get real technical, a little bit more line off here. But I, don't, I, like, I like leaving a bit of fat on, on the briskets. And yeah, that's the, these, these are the why these are winning award winning briskets. They're just perfect. Perfect for low and slow cooking. Remember to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And hopefully we're going to get some more first prizes and barbecue comps to show you. Have a great day.